What if I told you for the price of absolutely nothing, you can get access to over 100 VFX? You have my attention. But there you go. I just told you. Enjoy. Oh, you see here? My bad. To get access to these effects requires four steps. One, go to the link in the description. Two, download the plugin. Three, install the plugin. And four, enter the license key. The link in the description will take you to X Sessions YouTube channel. Here, the video is pretty much saying the same thing I'm about to tell you. So you basically go to the link here at the bottom. Go over here to purchase. Mine says purchase again because I already have it. Of course, yours should just say purchase. For the dollar amount, you can enter in zero if you want. But if you have anything, please feel free to contribute. You'll then be taken to this page where you can hit download. And this is also where you get the license key. It also will be emailed to you as well. Now, the plugin is new. You may encounter some bugs or glitches. If so, make sure you join the Discord so you can report them. Of course, the Discord is right up here. Once it's downloaded, you'll get a Lua file. Then install it. All you got to do is drag and drop right into the Fusion. Just drop it anywhere within the Fusion flow. Once that's done, go up here to Workspace. Go down to Council, and you should see down here where it says Install. Now, I don't have any access to the behind the scenes developing or anything like that, but for some reason they don't install, I just recommend rebooting DaVinci Resolve. If that doesn't work, go to the Discord server and report. Now, assuming it installed and you have no problems with it, go back up to Workspace, go to Scripts, go down to X Sessions, and then go to Editor's Lab, and, and then click Editor's Lab once again. When you first launch the Editor's Lab, it will ask you for a login, Basically, we'll just use the email that you use to download the Lua file, and then you'll enter in your license key. The plugin is broken up in different categories. You can click all and just have access to everything, and once you click on something, the page will change to reflect what you look, clicked on. If there are any new updates or anything, just go and click on what's new, and they'll show you what are the newer effects. Now, some of these effects are paid plugins. So if you go to like VHS scan lines, this one here is $10. As far as I know, all these effects are developed by people within the Ventures All community. Therefore, if you decide to purchase anything, you are directly contributing to a creator and helping develop the community even further. I also want to note too that this plugin does work with the free version of Venture Resolve. There's no need for the studio version. Everything, well, as far as I know, everything's compatible with the free version. So now I'm going to go here where it says raindrops. I'm going to click download. And one thing you have to notice when downloading something, here it'll tell you what it is. It's a macro auto. So it basically automatically installs. If I go back up to the VHS scan line, some of these will say fuse auto, which means it will automatically install, but it's a fuse, which means it has an external installation. Now you don't have to do anything in particular other than restart DaVinci Resolve. And then that plugin or whatever that you downloaded will be installed. So I'm gonna go back to raindrops. It says update now, cause I already installed it. I'm just click update again, it says done. Now I gotta do is click in my node flow, hit control and space. I'm just typing in raindrops and there it is. So I'm actually gonna minimize the screen and I'm just gonna move this over. I'm gonna hold shift, select this node and wait for the line to turn yellow and blue and then let go. Now we have raindrops. This is a pretty heavy effect, so it's gonna play back kind of slow. I'm taking it back to the edit page. Now you see you got the raindrops. Now, of course, there's a lot of customization stuff you can do. Going back into Fusion, click on the node, you have a list of controls. I'm not gonna go too deep into it. It's a free plugin, so make sure you download it. I don't want to ruin the surprise. But going back down here now, I'm going to maximize this back out. Got a couple 3D tools, got CRT and VHS effects, color grading effects, motion graphics. And this is an ongoing endeavor, which means they're going to continuously add more effects and more plugins and things like that. Like I said, I'm not going to go too deep into it. It's a free download. The link is in the description. If you have any problems, make sure you go down here to the Discord server and click on it. Join the server, post any problems or any glitches you may come across. Just keep in mind when you download something, if it says Fuse, you're going to have to restart DaVinci Resolve. If it just says micro, it'll automatically install. And then you just go into your tool select and type in the name of the tool that you downloaded. So shout out to everybody behind the production of this plugin. Like I said, they're going to be adding more and more to it as time goes on. So make sure y'all go and support. And keep the DaVinci Resolve community continuously growing. See y'all next time.